Today I'm going to show you how this Siberian boat trap works. And why I call this a Siberian boat trap is because when I found it, I was actually looking for some information for these people that's uh, living in Siberia. And they are called the Mansi people. And while I was uh, looking around for information of these Mansi people, I came over this uh, picture, uh, just a very simple picture in black and white drawing. And uh, I saw this boat trap and I thought to myself, wow, I got to do this one. So I printed it out and checked it out very carefully. But I couldn't figure out how, to, uh, how the mechanism was uh, working actually. But finally I found a way around the problem. And uh, now we're going to have a look of uh, how it works. Here we are then, and we're going to start the installation of the boat trap. And what we need, first of all, is two pieces of wood like this, like a V-shape, like a slingshot model. This is uh, where the uh, boat trap is going to rest upon. So we have to size them up the same length and stick them into the ground beside each other. So. I have prepared, of course, here and tested them. Two holes. Got to be sturdy. Check them out. You have the same height. Well, gonna do. Now when we have those two pieces of wood that I talked about first in the ground, we have to put on the, the boat trap, the two pieces of wood here and check them out so they are lying okay, so that it feels sturdy, and that feels okay right there. And I also use stone here for support, we'll show you later on. Why? Put it right there. Then I move over here, and this is uh, the path that is the move uh, the animal are moving on. And this is uh, first work you actually do. You find out where the deer or bears or whatever you're going to hunt. Where are they moving around? And you find that trail and you find a good spot where to put up the trap. And uh, just for today, to have something for the arrow to strike, we have this uh, target here. And this is the way the animal is going to move. going to go right here, right through here. Now we're going to put on the bow here, on the actual bow trap, and secure it properly. And I have put uh, two wooden pegs on it here as a support. Put the bow in the middle. Take a nice piece of strong leather thong and get it on tight well. This is, of course, very important tight. Tighten it very hard. First one in place. The second one. There we go. It 
feels good. Yep. <laughs>